met tons of good people. Like, it's nowhere near complete, that's for sure. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to day three of my Sturges experience. Hold on, airplane. Last night we uh, took a shuttle from our campground <clears throat> into town, parked the bikes for the night, went bar hopping. That was pretty cool. I, I liked having a shuttle and you don't have to risk drinking and driving or anything like that. So that was really good. Um, but yeah, we started up at One-Eyed Jack's and then we went down to the Knuckle and a few other bars. Uh, ended up at Iron Horse and we sat there at Iron Horse for a little while and uh, watched traffic go by, which was pretty fun. There was a lot of cool bikes, interesting bikes for sure. Um, met tons of good people. Like, yeah, like as I was just saying that, my neighbor's waving at me. But yeah, there's just tons of good people out here. It's like almost everybody you meet is really friendly. Um, they're wanting to tell you, you, yeah, they're all really eager around here to tell you where to go, where to stay away from, to give you the best experience. And I found that really cool. So today we are headed to the Black Hills. Uh, we're gonna do some riding. So we're gonna leave Sturges and then uh, go down to Nemo. From Nemo, we're gonna cut through and go to uh, 385, and 385 will take us all the way down to, what's that? Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> all right, sorry about that. Like I was saying, the neighbor uh, gave me some coffee. I was saying, everyone's really friendly around here. Uh, it's really great. Um, so like I was saying, We'll hit 385 and then uh, go all the way down to Crazy Horse and then to Custard. We'll probably eat lunch in Custard. Come back up uh, 89, I do believe. Yeah, 89. And then uh, go through Needles. Um, do Needles Highway, the famous Needles Highway. Probably take that 87 back to 16A. And then 16A is obviously Custard State Park and where we can uh, do Iron, the famous Iron Mountain Road. And then uh, we'll stop by Mount Rushmore. So yeah, so yeah, that's what we're doing today. We're about to jump on the bikes here and uh, head out. So see you on the road. Um, future Roswell Rider, roll that B-roll.
We are here at Crazy Horse. It looks itty bitty on the GoPro. I'll try to take a better uh, video on my phone. But so far, Black Hills, two thumbs up. Awesome, amazing, breathtaking. And to tell you the truth, if you get up early, the traffic hasn't been bad. The traffic hasn't been bad at all. Uh, uh, it's getting worse. It's getting worse the later it is. Yeah, yeah. It, it's like just starting to pick up, and it's like 10:30 right now. But like pretty much seven, eight, nine o'clock. It's been fine. But man, Crazy Horse is spectacular. When you come in to pay, and then the road coming in, this thing is just framed up perfect between the trees, and it looks awesome. So let me get a better video with my phone. What it originally looked like. Last year they were giving away a Chieftain Dark Horse and Ruby Smoke. This year it's a Challenger. It's a uh, raffle bike. Looks like it's $20 a ticket. And September 6th is the drawing. It's gonna be a little bit more than just a sculpture. It's gonna be a university. I think there's like an, an art building and uh, there's gonna be a museum and then there's gonna be like airstrips. And, it looks like there's a lake right there underneath him too. And then this is where we're at, the visitor center. So this is where we are. And that's him right there. And that's gonna be the campus. Yeah, so it's nowhere near complete, that's for sure. Nope. So we just finished up at Crazy Horse. Pretty dope. Yeah, they're gonna do a lot to this place. It's just the beginning, really. Like this whole mountainside is just gonna be full of uh, campuses and art studios and all kinds of, they got like a little town, really. Football fields. Yeah, two football fields is what we saw. Pretty cool. Definitely if you're in the area, stop by. It's, it's pretty, it's pretty huge. I'd be interested in coming back in 15, 20 years and seeing uh, how much work they got done to it. All right, we're gonna hit the road and uh, go eat some lunch and custard. Rushmore Company, the restaurant. We had a bite to eat. We're gonna get on down to Needle. Had a little beer. 
had a little pizza. We're headed to Needles. Let's go. Custard State Park. It's gorgeous. Breathtaking. We're about to do a Needles Highway through it. Go through all these rocks. So, hell yeah. Let's get it on.
All right, so we made it to Mount Rushmore. There it is. I highly recommend coming in here. It's only $10. There's been people that's telling us, nah, don't go, don't, you don't have to pay to go in. Go ahead and just stop on the side of the road and take a picture. You don't get really get that close. I highly recommend you, you go in because it's way better. Like you're, you're, we're way closer than anywhere on the road. So take it from me, pay the $10, go on in, it's great. Hell yeah. So this is our final stop for the day. And then we're gonna head back to the campground and maybe relax a little bit. All right, see you there. So we, uh, we're here back at camp. It was a awesome day. Uh, so we started in up in uh, Crazy Horse and then we dropped down to Custard, went around to Iron Mountain, did Needles uh, and Mount Rushmore. I, I think my favorite part of the whole day was just the curves. Going around those curves all day was just amazing. What was your favorite part? Mount Rushmore for sure. Yeah, Mount Rushmore is awesome. Definitely go in there, uh, pay your $10. Parking's free if you have a motorcycle, so just awesome it was it was great um yeah wonderful day i'll never forget it um thanks for joining us and uh this is the end of this video and join us for the next day to watch this sturgis experience keep on rolling